Hello, my name is Nathan. I'm your shopkeeper in the Gas Lamp District of San Diego. And I'm here to share some information and highlight some key characteristics of a category of hat known as the flat cap. A very traditional look of a flat cap is what we're gonna have as the ivy. No seams on the front, fully flat. Basically, this, the, the stitching will, as you're noticing, a lot of these is gonna dictate how it's gonna sit and fall onto the head for that cut, but you'll notice this more square right angled pattern on the back with three additional seams in the back which help that drop and hug the back of the head. And this one being a snap brim ivy. Low profile ivy, essentially sewn down. Take a snap brim, sew it down, you've got a low profile ivy. This one too being from our Ted's Cut and Sew line. Uh, got a nice khaki herringbone uh, wool. A plus fabric and material. Nice traditional look. You can imagine some of these being what originally came to the States and helped kick off the flat cap in America. Snap brim ivy, a little bit more room up here. Now as you'll notice with a ivy such as the hard eye, which is a low profile ivy from our Gorn Everyday collection, sewn down to the brim like we said, it's gonna allow it to sit a lot more form fitting at the front. These hug the head really nicely, especially in the back there. Um, pulled a little bit tighter here to the front, so it's definitely going to create a bit more of a pocket in the back. You still have that uh, right angle seam there on the side. A nice feature of this one, however, and you'll find this in a few of our other uh, flat caps and ivies, ear flap warmers. When the temperatures drop, nice herringbone on the interior. And then you got that extra added warmth. So sunrise to sunset, bike ride home, evening wine in the park. You can wear your flat cap anytime for work or play. Last but not least, we have the Tony Diamante, which is going to be a three panel ivy, straight seam, front to back, front to back, one, two, three. It's very much gonna have a deeper pocket in the head, still slims out towards the peak. Uh, this is actually made up of a wool polyester blend, otherwise known as a workwear fabric. And uh, for some time, flat caps have been stereotyped as being a working man's hat. Undoubtedly, they're classless, and that's where their strengths lie. So I hope that you've been able to gather a bit of insight from this tutorial that we provided for you on the flat cap, and that it will make your selection for your next flat cap all the more easier.